Check in with meteorologist Vivian Rennie. Happy Monday, first of all. And uh, what is weather looking like this week? This weekend was pretty gorgeous. It really was. We saw really those comfortable conditions sticking around on the central coast, right around normal for this time of the year. I'm going to show you the daytime highs just yesterday. This also is a really good map of those typical normals for this time of the year, something we haven't seen in a while, those mid-80s in the interiors. Now, something kind of interesting about the month of October is it takes those seasonal normals from the upper 80s in the Paso Robles area to the mid-70s. So we're definitely in that transitional period of the year. Much cooler conditions are expected before you know it. 77 degrees yesterday in San Inez, 73 in Santa Maria, and 64 degrees in Cambria. Overall, comfortable. Starting off the day with that fog, clearing out by the afternoon. We'll rinse and repeat and see that exact same condition expected for today. Starting off with that fog, a little bit of dense fog along our south coast, some in the Paso Robles area. But the good news is the vast majority of those clouds that are being monitored on this monitor are just that cloud cover. They're not really that close to the surface. That being said, we do have some limited visibilities in northern San Luis Obispo County, especially up near Lake Nascimento. That's where we're seeing those most limited visibilities. Just take it slow on those roads where visibilities may fall. Pretty much everyone is seeing at least some cloud cover to start off the morning. The good news is visibilities aren't too affected on our roadways. Temperatures across the region very much consistent. So we've got these onshore winds taking that air that is very much marine influence, pretty much the exact same temperature as those oceans and bringing them to our communities. 57 degrees in Paso Robles, San Luis Obispo, Santa Maria, San Inez, and Lompoc this morning, as well as up in Cambria. 58 in the Cuyama Valley, 61 degrees in Santa Barbara as you head out the door. You might want that extra layer. You might need it for a little longer along those beaches, but it won't be too bad of a day no matter where you are. 85 degrees in Paso Robles, very comfortable. A couple degrees above normal. 73 in San Luis Obispo, 71 for Santa Maria, 68 degrees in Lompoc, and 72 degrees in Santa Barbara for today. Along our north coast, Cayucas at 65, 85 in San Miguel, and 73 degrees in Avila Beach. In the five cities communities, also very much comfortable in the 60s. 65 in Pismo Beach, 80 in California Valley, and 71 degrees in Napomo. And for our south coast, go lead at 68 degrees, 79 in the Cuyama Valley, and 67 degrees in Vandenberg. Now, over the next few days, things are going to change slightly. Starting off with this very much typical flow, these onshore winds, nothing too bad, a little bit of a high pressure just off towards our east, but we will be seeing another system making its way towards us. It's this little wrinkle in the jet stream making its way in from the Aleutians. That's going to be bringing some significant rain to the Pacific Northwest. But for us, it could bring a tiny bit of drizzle. This is mainly Wednesday night into early Thursday morning. But mainly just winds and waves are expected to kick up over the last couple of days of this week. We'll warm up slightly for the weekend. Then another larger system is likely to bring us more significant rain by the middle of next week. So it's a while before that gets here. But that small system on Wednesday staying near comfortable for this time of the year all the way through the extended forecast. A little bit more of that cloud cover each and every morning. Dylan, back to you.